What do you think there, buddy? He says, I think it's going to be really nice out here today. Again. Looks like it's going to stay this way. Mostly through the weekend, Abby. Trouble? Much. Well, it's a good thing I know how to break into a spider. Because I just locked all my stuff in the, in the spider. And I uh, realized that the spider key was in the house. Well, the keys to get in the house were locked in my backpack, which is locked in the spider. Okay, all the keys are sorted out. Bikes running. <laughs> Everything's locked up that needs to be locked up and unlocked that needs to be unlocked. Let's go to work. Once again, we start another day on a beautiful day. Well, I'm down here in Vancouver and it is 75 degrees. Holy moly, am I hot and what I'm wearing. One morning I don't pay attention to the weather, you know, always look, I just take a peek, see where we're at and <laughs> what it's gonna be to get an idea of, you know, how hot it's gonna be in Vancouver and I try to, you know, deal with the cold as much as I can so I don't have to at the first part because it starts to warm up pretty quick as I come on now people, play friendly here. You just completely ran that red light taking that left hand turn there. Let's see what's going on in the shop today. Oh man, she's gonna be a warm ride going home tonight. Isn't that something? Wow. It's funny. I've got the dirtiest spider in the whole store. How was that? Another Amtrak and being passed by another Amtrak. 93 degrees now. This little spot right through here is usually the hottest, the hottest spot on my ride home. So I'm, uh, I'm in the Longview Kelso area. I'm actually in on the Kelso side. Longview's uh, west of me here. And uh, 95. 95 degrees. It's been that way since just the other side of Kalama. You see what the, the uh, Three Rivers Mall says uh, 95. You guys can make that out. I'm going to cycle through by the time we get through. Here we are. Watch, watch, watch. 95 degrees. Well, hello there. I have made it home. Crazy old Leo went buck wily as usual. Got all got himself all kinds of excited. <laughs> yeah, he's still whining. Oh, look at the flowers and stuff. Yeah, yeah. There's somebody driving down the road. Let's go out here and see what the. I see the horses knocked her. God, they went through all that water. That's what that's what Tuff does when a when a water bucket runs out and he kicks it over. So I got to go in there and get that turned over and get the water going on it. So anyway, I'm gonna go do that. Get the spider inside and and we'll go from there. She's a beautiful, beautiful evening. Look at that cherry tree. All the blooms and that thing. Is that beautiful or what? Alright. So I gotta tend to things. And you get some nice weather and the bees go crazy. I'm getting them all loaded up for the for the hee hauls. They all came and got their drink and went off to do whatever. <laughs> hell's that all about? <laughs> now the dogs all freak out. 
Who is that? Who is that, Abby? Is that the mama? Are you excited? Is that the mama? Were you, were you hot? That was very hot. It was 95 coming home. Yeah. Sophie, you can't crawl up in well, there. I that I had the air conditioner going all the way home until I hit Jackson and rolled down the window. Leo! I'm dying! Yes, I think I'm gonna die. You guys quit attacking her. Trouble? Trouble. That's enough. Trouble. <laughs> Right now. You leave her alone. All right. Poor old Madison. <laughs> well, hello there, you two. <laughs> Probably a little late for using the Hero 3 Plus for porch vlog. For about 15 minutes from sunset, but the mountains make it seem like it's way sooner than what it is. Plus the, the forest there kind of blocks it as well. But anyway. Let me just make it short and sweet. There we go. I'm tired and I got a lot of editing to do. It was They're a, making enough noise yeah. to wake the dad. That's Leo eating in his chain thing. It's hitting his bowl. He's got his own special bowl. He's a big old spoiled baby. Yeah. Good lord. Abby Lane, that is not yours. You already yeah. ate yours. <laughs> that scared her. I know it. <laughs> you leave him alone. You already ate yours. All right, leave the bowl alone now. We got the front door open and they're just kind of coming and going. Sophie is a, like a high traffic dog. She's in, she's out. She's in, she's out. That's I know, she can't make up her mind what she wants. She's such a goof. Other than to go steal, you know, Kleenex out of the bathroom and rip it up all over the floor. Yeah, she's got this little thing and I think she's trying to tell us something. She's not happy about something. She'll go and pull a little Kleenex, you know, Kelly blow in her nose, whatever. Comes out right in the middle of the floor and shreds it in a bunch of little pieces and leaves it in a little pile. Why not? But she's trying to tell us something. I just don't know what. It's not yeah, like... that she's psycho. That she needs to go outside or something because oh, I've had the sorry. front door open sorry, since so. I've been home. So she can come and go. I don't know. It's not that she needs water. There's water. Yeah. Well, maybe she it was her, her evening snack she wanted. Or it was like, where's mama? Why is it just you here? Because it it's fine, come home, go out, walk to Kelly, come back, and she's made the mess. And it, there's no way she got in here that fast. And whatever, she's a goof. She's always done that, though. Gleezy's little... <laughs> That's a happy goof. No, no, no stay, stay down. down. <laughs> yeah. Oh, liquor, liquor. But I'm a meathead suddenly decides that she needs to give us all this affection. I'm just going all over with this camera. Swinging every which way. Kind of yeah, it's like meow, 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 all over. They're all no, getting, let's not wrestle now. They're all getting drunk on the <coughs> on the thing. So, how'd your, how'd your day go? It went good. It was busy. I'm tired. I'm just like... Mm. <laughs> nice. It was, got up to 95 on the way home today. That was crazy. Yeah, it, it was intense. I rode all the way home with the air conditioner on, and that says a lot for me. Cause yeah, she don't ever turn the air conditioner on. She'll just crack the window and leave it like that. But it was like really hot, and then you couldn't breathe. And I'm going, okay. If they have I the air conditioner on at the store. I'm just, oh yeah. <laughs> it's a blazing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was nice. That was our salvation. Yeah. Yeah, nice thing the Longview store. The air conditioner has always worked really, really well. You can, I mean, you could turn that place into ice box if you kick her down enough. Oh yeah. The Vancouver store gets there, but uh, that's a huge door to try to air condition. You get up on the roof, and all there is is all these air conditioner units everywhere. It's like, Whoo, I need to pay that electricity bill. Yeah, I wouldn't. Yeah, the meter has got to go. Yeah, but we got a meter for every unit up there. So. And I freak <laughs> over our bill. Yeah, that's yeah. crazy. Here the Harleys riding by out there. Get a nice all day, right and they all head up, head up to Mount St. Helens. All the guys from up north. This is the route they take up right past my house. The guys from the south take Spirit Lake Highway up, and we used to live at Silver Lake. And we're on one end of the lake, and we're next to the lake where you hear it echoing. There's this one spot where they have to come around the lake on Spirit Lake Highway, 
and you hear the Harleys echoing across the, you know, because there's nothing interrupting the sound. But it's weird, for the last 15 years, we've been hearing motorcycles go up to the mountain. Oh, yeah. And, uh, oh, man, every Saturday and Sunday morning, you all you hear is herds of motorcycles going up to the mountain. It starts to get towards the evening, you hear them all coming back. Yeah. If you drive up there on especially these early, um, you know, get these spring, these nice spring days. Oh man, you never seen so many motorcycles. It's oh like, yeah. Good lord. Yeah, there was a ton on the freeway when I was coming home. Oh yeah, I was passing them left and right. It's crazy. Everybody's out and about. You're all uh, quit eating their head. <laughs> Damn, but whoa. You don't yeah, pay attention to that gimbal, it just takes off on me. Yeah. <laughs> Happy. Are you, are you dying for affection or something, Don? Yeah, I love you and thank you. You just smacked me right in the glasses. I thought, well, it's a good thing I can't see out that side because that's the side you lick. Yep. I hate that when they come up to you and you're sitting there and you talk to them and they go right in your glasses. Yeah. <laughs> you think they got a smudged eye. Yeah. Oh, I see you. I see ya. I'll give you all kinds of affection okay. here when I'm done. Here, here. Come on, that's enough. Sit, sit on the floor. You sit, sit on the floor and they go sit. nuts. Yeah, just sit there, baby. It's all right. And no feet. No pawns. So anyway, I didn't even look at see what the weather is tomorrow. Thinking about riding something different, but it seems like there was like a 10% chance of rain or something. I, no. I, or was I that Saturday and Sunday? Yeah, Saturday. But, uh, I think it's back to zero on Sunday. Yeah. But anyway, we'll get some riding in, do something over the over the weekend. But anyway, we, I mean, as you can see, we literally have nothing to talk about. You know, I'm, well, I'm tired because it's hot and I've got, I was in there sorting through uh, my uh, footage there to see what, it, what I have for today. I did like two moto vlogs and then the little snippets that I do for the daily vlog as I as I ride along. Watch out them mosquitoes yeah, eat you. Mosquitoes are out. Yeah. I so, need to get me some miracles. They don't like miracles. Mm. So I apologize for like no stories at all. I know Just we kind of no talked about the weather. Tonight. Yeah. It's nice out. We shouldn't be talking about the weather other than going, it was a wonderful night. And leave it at that. Yeah. <laughs> but Sorry. <laughs> I know. I literally have nothing to say. We yeah. we just need to we just need to let you go for the day. Yeah. Tomorrow's yeah. Friday. We'll be all happy and giddy that it's Friday and Somebody will. we'll see uh yeah, her her Friday is on Saturday night. But anyway, yeah. We should let y'all go. You guys have a good night. Thank you so much for watching. We will talk to you tomorrow, same smoke time, same smoke channel. Alrighty. We'll see you guys. Bye, everybody. Have a wonderful day now. Bye-bye.